Hey, it's Dwayne here at the Clemente Museum, and we wanted to talk to you a little bit about Clemente Night at Three River Stadium. That would be July 24th, 1970. It's shortly after the opening of, the, of Three River Stadium. They have Clemente Night. What Roberto does with Clemente Night is he turns the whole thing into a fundraiser, um, which is something that he always did. Roberto's like, let's take care of Children's Hospital and he gets all the donations for that night, everything that comes in, money. They sent all kinds of s supplies and different like uh, gifts like TVs and jewelry and all that. He, all that stuff went to Children's Hospital. And that's a typical Roberto Clemente story right there. Actually, there was so much stuff donated that they pulled a truck out onto Three Rivers uh, Stadium onto the field and they put all the stuff on the truck and people brought them just everything you could ever, ever imagine. Somebody donated a set of winter car tires. So it was a pretty awesome night. They did a Clemente Night poster. They did a brochure, Clemente Night brochure. The Clemente Night sign that we have, that we got from through Hunt Auctions, the family ended up selling it a few years ago and we acquired that sign and it's a piece of the museum now. A lot of stuff going on that night. They flew, uh, 250 Puerto Ricans flew in um, to come see Roberto and be out on the field because it was pretty big, uh, a lot of festivities going on, um, a lot of crying, a lot of tears. There's some, the most beautiful shot of Vera and Roberto hugging. Um, Roberto starts talking and he starts getting teared up and Robert, uh, Vera gives him this hug and it's this beautiful image. And that famous shot of Roberto Jr. kissing the poster is actually from that night. A lot of people think that that image um, is from after his death and he's sad about him dying, but it's not. It's a poster that they made for Clemente night and they had him in the stadium and Roberto bends down and gives the poster a kiss. Everybody really gravitates towards that one. It got Dusty Baker to get teary eyed and he, he had to uh, look away when we were doing a tour. And then we learned a, a great story from Luis Mayoral, who's a big, uh, big uh, friend of the Clemente Museum. We have all these photos that Les Banos took on the field, and this uh, woman comes from, from Puerto Rico, and she's representing the governor, and she brings this trophy with like a plaque with a little box, and it had dirt in it with a little bit of straw. And when they're presenting it to Roberto with Bob Prince, and Vera's there, and Vera, the whole time, all these photos, she's laughing and smiling. And I'm like, Luis, why was, why was Vera laughing? And he goes, well, when we hand Roberto the, the trophy with the dirt, Roberto says, hey, Luis, how many cows you think pooped in that dirt? Right there when they're presenting it to him. And Vera cracked up, she couldn't stop. And I called Luis the other day to, to double check that story. And he said, you know, that's just the way Roberto was. Um, he, he was just a funny guy and always cracking some, some quick ones like that. So take a look for that too when you come here for a tour. Um, so thanks for watching.